So this Kata application has a, a number of pieces here. Um, you can add and edit different Katas. You can view your dashboard and you can use AI to generate different aspects of the Kata. In this little application, you'll see these applications that Practi provides are very simplistic looking. It's, it's by design. It's to try to make this process be ex uh, accessible to people um, uh, in a, a way that's familiar and, and not overwhelming. So we have a list view. These are the, there's three demonstration katas in here. Um, you also can have a Kanban view, which you know you can assign. You can see which katas are in progress and which are completed. I'll, I'll pause before I show you the dashboard and the executive summary. But if I click here, you basically generate a new kata. Now that kata has in this design a few sections, kind of an overview section where who are you assigning to? It's to me. Um, what's the area you're going to try to work on? This is just editable. What's the date of the kata? What's the priority you're placing on this one? And you know, is it on track or off track overall to, to improve the kata? Then we put uh, a charting mechanism in here where you can uh, track the actual improvement percent you're trying to get against whatever metric you're you're trying to create. Now, if we work with you on a you know a client basis, we can design these with different metrics and different tracking and really whatever you want to do. This is just an example that shows the the uh, percentage gain in a chart. Um, now, to begin the process, we talked about defining the kata itself, and there's these links here that you can jump to the different sections. So, in defining the kata, here I'll go full screen on this. Um, you basically, what is your current challenge? And you can come in here and you can enter your challenge. In this case, current challenge is lead generation process, not working as expected. Every company has that problem. Um, more leads is always better. Um, the, the, uh, that's the challenge. The current condition is they're generating about 10 le leads a week through partnership recognitions, um, need a way to track and organize leads better. Um, so that, that's the current condition, the challenge. What's the target? Simple, want to get want to 5X that. We want to get to 50 leads a week. Okay, so how are you going to do that? What's the experiment? Well, we're going to set up MailChimp and we're going to begin cold calling. And you set up a few ideas of what you're going to do to try to make a change. Now, this could be applied to scrap. It could be applied. This is a very sort of uh, um, sales-based or marketing-based um, challenge, but it could be applied to anything. So then as part of that uh, uh of that um, process you laid out here, what's the experiment, you can define the key actions. Now, AI can also create key actions for you to do based on this. So instead of you taking the time, if I click this, it'll automatically generate all of your actions and then you can start assigning them to users or set dates on them. So um, it, it, it's, it uh, again, accelerates the work uh, at the point of work for the for the work you're trying to do. So you go and you begin that process and you begin working. Then if I jump down here to the coaching section, so now working with your mentor, your coach, you say, okay, you know, the target condition that we're trying to achieve is 50 leads a week. The updated condition is we're at 20 uh, MailChimp and cold calls. What are the challenges that are coming in, you know, in your plan, do, check, act kind of thinking? What are the challenges that you're, uh, you're, uh, having and executing against your target uh, condition. Well, the experiment with, you know, started with potentials, we're having particular issues, et cetera. And so then you come up with a new or modified ex experiment to improve the process. So that's effectively the overall process. And then what happens here is you can come down and generate a summary. So if I click this, I won't do it because it takes about 25 seconds currently. These models are getting faster and faster, but basically it then generated this um, a summary of the current status of the condition. And in our workflow system, we can automatically email that out to any of our constituents or any of our users. So you can send it out to management or to the plant stakeholders and say, hey, here's where we are in our current kata, uh, et cetera. So, the, again, the process is you start with the improvement that you're trying to achieve. You lay out your challenge, your current condition, your target condition, and the experiments you're going to run. You then use AI to generate your tasks, edit those tasks, and assign them to people. You then go through the coaching process, and you can work this out with your mentor how often you want to do it, but you go through your coaching process um, with uh, your mentors and come up with new experiments you can do, and then you can generate summaries. Now, at a certain point, you'll have um, all these katas and it'll move to completed. You've reached your goal and you can start new ones. Now, you can use this application. You can view it, as I said, in Kanban view or list view. 
to manage and generate and work with as many of these as you want to at any one time with your mentor and team. And then you can get a full dashboard that shows you how each of them are doing against your target uh, percentage completions. One of the nice things about using a consistent metric like percentage of completion, and you can apply that to, you know, my goal is this and my current status is this, and, and you can set any sort of, you know, you can use that with any type of metrics to get a percentage achievement, is that you can create a consistent view of all of your different goals in one place. You can also look at all of your katas and where they are by status. You can attach files. Those files can link to OneDrive or you can be or Google or uploaded directly in here, uh, et cetera. And then you can also see this is an executive summary of all of the katas, where they are. And again, that can be emailed out to your team automatically. So again, this is one application. Uh, Praxi has dozens and dozens of applications that we have AI embedded uh, processes in. The word Praxi means the practical application of knowledge. So we try to use AI in 